What happened? What happened, dammit? Is that I fell and cracked me damn leg in two? Stop whining, Peter. I'm ashamed to hear it. Pull yourself together, man. Worst case, Henrik will whittle you a wooden leg. Old Ola's got one, and you don't hear him complaining. Old Ola's also got lice, stinks, and leaks out of both ends. Yet he don't complain about that either. You two gonna help or no? How do you fall? We set out to light a fire there. Atop of the statue's shoulders. For our own glory and that of our ancestors. Looks like you succeeded. Hey, but the fire won't big so quick Petter jumped back. Lost his balance. Got lucky anyway. Could have broken his neck falling from that height. This statue, what is it? An altar to the god of warriors. Any man who dares climb it and light the fire gains the favor of the gods. Fame and... And an excellent chance of snapping his leg off at the arse. Are you gonna help me or are you gonna continue preaching? This celandine should help you. Won't mend your leg, but it will make it hurt less. Thanks. Our undying gratitude that gets you. The gratitude of a dying man in my case. Enjoy it while it lasts. Shut it and show me that leg. Thanks again. God's guide ye. Geralt? Ever think about the past? About your time with the hunt? At times, I'm amazed we survived. Eridan's not usually one to leave witnesses behind. That's just it. He didn't. Lost my memory when I escaped the hunt. Ah, oh, yes. Your famous amnesia. You didn't have it? For a short time only. Once the Emperor's mages got their hands on me, my memory quickly returned. Why didn't you look for me, after you'd recovered your memory and your freedom? I assumed you would recover quickly and find me first. You had mages to help you. I was on my own. Well, not entirely. Besides, I knew you'd fled the hunt. Eridan would never have let you go. He'd erased my memory, but you escaped. It was wholly possible he hadn't had the chance with you. And there were your Witcher mutations. I expected they'd stave off any serious injury. How do you go from being the Emperor's hostage to being his ally? One day, the door of my cell opened, and instead of seeing the usual officer, I saw Emir. He promised to release me and grant me free reign of the Imperial Treasury, provided I did what he asked. He told you about Ciri, and you accepted his offer. Why? Shared aims make for strange bedfellows. I knew I had to find Ciri before Eridan did. And if any man had the power and the means to help me, it was the Emperor. Besides, once all said and done, he is her father. What did Eridan want from you exactly? The same thing he wanted from you. You don't recall? Draw a blank on most of my time with him. We were bait, Geralt. Both of us. Eridan believed Ciri would come for us sooner or later and he would capture her. Fortunately, she didn't fall for it. When the hunt had you, hope they didn't hurt you. Even if they did, I've no memory of it. The whole time's but a string of phantom images. Blood and fire. A wild chase through different worlds. All shrouded in fog. Though I do remember you coming for me. Trading your life for mine. I hadn't the chance to thank you then. You'd have done the same for me. I'm touched by your certainty. But you've yet to tell me how you escaped them. Wouldn't mind knowing that myself. There are times I remember rushing forward, red riders around me. Next thing I know, I'm in the woods at the foot of Kaer Morin. That's it. Still can't get something out of my mind. What? Got summoned by Radovid. He wants me to find Philippa. What a king. Not only cruel, but naive as well. Did he truly believe you'd help him? I took the job. Why? 
gotta say I'm curious what happened to her. And I didn't want any Redanians getting in my way while I tried to find out. Look, found this in Philippa's hideout. A Megascope crystal? Damn, it's cracked. But it could still work. And Francesca's equally hesitant. Neither she nor Ida wishes to decide blindly. They'll stop hesitating as soon as we convince Kira and Fringilla. Fringilla's on our side. She'll join us as soon as she's finished some business in Nilfgaard. Wonderful. That leaves Kira. The problem is, I've still no notion where she could be. Yennefer and Triss. Yennefer's never belonged to the Lodge. And Triss? Well, we shall see. I must regain my vision. I can go to Novigrad, then see Arthur de Ballista. The word is, Triss is also carousing about the city. You still insist? Phil, pardon my saying so, but you will never regenerate your eyes on your own. Vilgefortz did it. I'm employing the same method, cultivating tissue on precious stones. It's madness. You will need its power. You'll put yourself in great danger. Damn it. That's it. I can't recover any more. I hear right. They mentioned the Lodge? Yes. And later, Philippa said something about vision regeneration. Margarita mentioned Ida and Francesca, then Kira and Fringilla. I've little doubt Philippa means to revive the Lodge of Sorceresses. They weren't sure about Triss. Excluded you right away. I'd never agree to rejoin. Philippa believes only the Lodge can look after the Mage's interests effectively. I disagree, and prefer to act alone. Besides, the moment's inopportune. Reviving the Lodge would enrage both Radovid and the Emperor. They're at a critical stage of their duel for influence, and neither would welcome a new player. Think Philippa pulled it off? Restored her eyesight? It would be reckless, but not impossible. They seemed to say she was planning to implant tissue grown on precious stones. Till now, only Vilgefortz has ever managed. If she succeeded, well, I suppose congratulations would be in order. Hmm. Wonder what I should do with the crystal. It cannot fall into Radovid's hands, not under any circumstances. You'd better leave it with me. Right. It'll be safer with you. Geralt? Found something that might belong to you. That skull some sort of accessory? If so, you've changed your style a bit. It's a weapon. Don't remember ever seeing you with that? It's as you said. I've changed my style. Thanks, Yen. See you later. You come to sell them at market. Oh, Any magic ones? <laughs> Where are you scurrying to, Rich? Let's see your pass. Pass? What pass? Kind of pass confirms you ain't no mage. Can't enter or leave Novigrad without it. Why have you shut the city gates? So as we can clean it of mages, witches, and other scum that's crawled here since the war began. Hang to catch every last one of them, toss them on a flaming pyre like poxy livestock. Sorry, don't have a pass. You'll scurry no further then. Next! Hang on, how do I get one? Start by making an offering to the church. Then you'll need three pure souls to confirm... Let him through. Here's his papers. What? But we Not your concern. Back to your post. Regards from Siggy Reuven.
Great the ginger pig hides behind a witchcraft. We'll find it. Matter of time. But I paid in advance, the entire month. You did. But you paid the old price. The risks are greater now, and so should the rewards be. I'm out of coin. But you've got something else, dear. Give us a necklace and get out of here! Hands off or I'll cut them off. Geralt, you don't need to. I wanna. Grab your things and let's go. Get out! Now! When I need your help, I'll ask for it. What? Are you angry? Oh, angry? No. But they deserved the necklace. They risked a lot just by sheltering me. I was worried about you. City's crawling with hunters. I know. We had everything in place. We were ready to sail. But the hunters moved faster. They locked all the gates, placed guards at every corner, all in one night. Then they started searching the city, street by street, house by house. They stop anyone who seems even slightly suspicious. Mostly it's common folk with rabbit's foot charms or lucky horseshoes. But sometimes they get it right. Arrest actual mages. How can I help? Everything's falling apart. I don't know where to start. I should get all the mages to the docks as soon as possible. Get them on board this ship. But Berthold and Anise have yet to show up at the meeting point. Berthold and Anise? Who are they? A young couple. He's an alchemist. Had a practice in Gildorf. She studied at Aratusa. I'm worried the people who hit them might have turned them in. See? My hosts weren't all bad. Won't be easy getting to the port. Lots of guardsmen in the streets. So we won't take the streets. In case of trouble, we were all to meet at the Kingfisher. There's a passage into the sewers from the cellar, and apparently those can get you all the way to the docks. I know the Novigrad sewers. Won't run into any hunters there, but that doesn't mean it'll be safe. That's why I'm asking you. I need you to find the way to the docks, clear the path for the others, and do it quickly. The hunters could figure out our plan any minute. Now you understand my predicament? Mm -hmm. Help too and put all the others at risk. Or go straight to the Kingfisher, abandon the two to certain death. What do I do, Geralt? We should help Anise and Berthold. To write them off like that, it'd be cruel. Fine. But then we need to go now. Clock's ticking. Lead the way. Well? Gotcha! Not far, in the bits. Now, quiet, Geralt. We'd rather not draw any attention to ourselves. A patrol. We can't let them see us. She's into the witchcraft too. Good work. Take him. No, I beg you. We've done nothing wrong. Right. Hear that several times a day. What? Uh, what about my reward? Reward. Very cold. I'm the witcher. Land on two fires. Now we'll have four. Ah. 
You all right? Can you walk? Yeah, yes. I'll not leave here. I'm no fool. Bertold. Have you seen what's happening out there? They'll catch us before we can reach the port. Catch us and kill us. We're going now. Go going. Thanks. We need to join the others as soon as possible. Two more! Grab them! Have you checked the sewers beneath the Kingfisher? No. Didn't think we'd have to take that route. To think a year ago, guardsmen bowed to mages they passed in the street. Right. Now we have to flee the city like rats. You could stay. You'd manage it somehow. The others will never make it without me. Sight. Everything seems in order. Or we can't. They're here already. You should have run. Get it from Damn it. We took too long. Too long? We set out to rescue two people. Yes. And lost one. Knew exactly what he was signing up for. Small comfort. This is no time to mourn. Come with me. This way, Geralt. Triss? What happened upstairs? Is everything all right? No. Everything's not all right. Gerald, wait a minute. I need to see who made it. By the tears, my dear lady. You shouldn't worry yourself. It tarnishes your beauty. Guess you must have worried quite a bit. No, I was born ugly. You fleeing to Kavir too? No, but I am helping the others set off. You know me. Bleeding heart. It only start bleeding now. They've been burning mages for months around here. But only since recently on this scale. Besides, I look forward to having friends in Kavir. Especially among King Tancred's entourage. <laughs> Trace is about to speak. We'll talk later. We've waited long to escape. Till we could make sure Kavir would take us. Till we could acquire enough coin to hire a ship. Till we could find a captain we could trust. We've waited too long. There's no more time for hesitation. We must leave Novigrad today. This is madness. Hunters stand on every corner. So we'll get to the port through the sewers. Garrett will clear a safe path for us. They'll catch us anyway. You'll see. They'll catch us and kill us. Perhaps. In which case we'll die with dignity. Weapons in hand. Not tied to a stake. Begging for mercy. If the need arises, I'll defend you. You can also count on my help. Yes, the help of a Redanian spy. 
Radovid's right hand man. That was long ago, sir. You raised that madman. You taught him to kill. You. This is no time to settle past scores. End of discussion. I'm gonna head to the sewers now. I'll signal when the path's clear. You follow my trail. Don't stray from it, no matter what. I will go with Geralt. You, Dijkstra, go to the port and see that everything's in order with the ship. On my way. We'll meet there. I hope. Triss, really want to go with me? No offense, but... Offense taken. Stop talking and lead the way. I swear. I'll drop magic for good. If I can only bloody get out alive. Good luck. Thanks for helping. No need to thank me, really. No, there is. You don't know how much it means. To have someone you can rely on in this fucking city. It's alright. It'll be over soon. Hmm. Soon. You should have run. <laughs> On the other side? Mm hmm. Elven ruins, or an old forgotten cellar. Maybe we can get around the blockage through there. Can't hurt to try. Got nothing to lose at this point. A library? Look. Gonzalo de Verseo's poems. Jacob of Veraza's chronicles. It's incredible. Rare, first editions only. We'll come back for them later. No, we won't. I leave Novograd today, remember? I remember. Just having a hard time coming to grips with it. Come on. We should hurry. Triss, found an exit. <sighs> for a minute, I actually thought we were doomed. have tended to disappear without a trace. Everything all right? A few bites on my feet and calves. Nothing really. Need to clean your wounds. Infection will set in otherwise. Later, Geralt. Let's find the way to the port first. Body's pale. Dried out. around the neck and shoulders. Claw marks, long and sharp. Lantern still lit. Died recently, from bites to the neck. A lesser vampire, stay close to me.
watch out for it. source of income. Come on, let's go. Seagulls! Hear them? We made it! Come on, we need to ready the ship before the hunter... Finally. You bloody took long enough. Did you have time to look around? How's the ship? Creaky piece of junk. Wood's rotting. Sails are prone to rip like an old pair of knickers. And the... Will we make it to Kavir? Provided you don't run into any storms. I'll signal the others to come. Any help? Can I play the violin for you? Fetch some flowers or bonbons. What the hell's that mean? What? Don't tell me you don't plan to beg her to stay. Why do you even care? I adore love stories. Especially the ones that end happily ever after. Hunters! Hunters approaching! Board the ship! We want them alive! Bloody blasted like a cowie! No time for courtesies, my dear. Get on board. One last farewell. Thank you. I'll never forget what you did for me. And what we had together. Stay with me. Carol, not this again. Especially not here. Not now. Miss Marigold! We got a sail. Please. We had our chance, but let it go. I... I love you. Miss Mary Gold, we're casting off! Well, mate, at least you tried. A sorceress turned me down once. Want to hear the story? Go for it. What's the harm? As you know, my heart fluttered for Philippa Eilhart back when we both served Redania. One day, I doused myself in fragrances like a whore in a heat wave, put on a pinstripe doublet, they make you look slimmer, you know. And I went to her, told her, Philippa, with so much in common, and so on. You know what she said? Pinstripes hadn't slimmed you down enough? No. She said, Gerald, turn around. Not in the mood for jokes. No, I'm serious. Turn around. Triss? I thought... So did I. But I changed my mind. Thank you. I'm grateful. Dijkstra, no offense, but... Leaving, already gone. Let's go somewhere. I know a spot where we can watch the ships. Lead the way.
They're safe now, right? Yes, you can stop worrying, really. Oh, you're right. Just hard to believe it's over and done with. I've dreamt of this moment for months. Promise me one thing. You'll stop risking your life for others. No. No? Triss, not a mage left in Novigrad. But you're here. I can defend myself. Well, from Kikimors, Griffins, Bruxay, but not from the hunt. You and Siri will need my help, and I'll be at your side. Is how you imagined things? No. I imagined I'd be on the ship with the rest of them, and you'd be on shore, waving a handkerchief, maybe. I hope you don't regret it, that things have gone differently. Well, they say Kavir's lovely this time of year, but I prefer you. <laughs> Not surprised. I'm pretty lovely this time of year, too. I won't disagree. We might still go there one day when it's all over. That would mean balls and banquets, and other boring things that start with a B. Mm-hmm, but also baths, bombs, body massages. You can make up for all those years you slept in the bushes and bathed in mountain streams. Sounds tempting. Would I have to give up being a witcher? No, you'd take a monster contract from time to time to stay sharp. Nothing too dangerous, though, so I wouldn't have to worry. And I'd be waiting for you. Let me guess. With a candlelit dinner? Candles, sure. And a bed. Actually, we've never needed either. Look, they're signaling us. It's a message. H L A K B R Hol Lakba. It makes no sense. It's Ko. What did you expect? Thank you, Geralt, for this, and for what you said at the port. I should have said it long ago. So, what happens now? Afraid it's a bit too early for happily ever after. We'll get our happy ending one day. Yes, somewhere over hill and dale. It's a cruel world we live in. It's hard to make plans. Even harder to invest any faith in them. Though you might want to, badly. You were in an entirely different mood a moment ago. Hush. The spark expired. Don't worry about me, Geralt. And please, be careful. I've got to find Ciri. I'm close. I will find her. Or someone who knows what happened to her. Where will we meet? Can only think of one place where both witchers and sorceresses are welcome. Care more. I haven't been there in a while. So, I guess I'll see you, Witcher. I'll miss you. A lot. 
I miss you too. Men's fragrance, acrid sweat, and chestnut balm for aching joints. Dijkstra. Ah, those witches' senses. Can't hide a damn thing from you lot. Same seems to be true for you. Will you ever leave me alone? Someday, sure. Once I no longer need you. <sighs> Dijkstra, what are you plotting this time? What would you say? How many mages did we save, altogether? Dunno. Didn't count. Thirty, maybe? Give or take a few? And how many would you say remain in the North? How many alchemists, healers, herbalists? Two thousand? Three? Doing a population count? Is that it? No, I'm concerned. In Novograd they had us, we were here. But who'll save those in Rimba, Banard? Ard Kareg, Gullet. You know damn well that daft bastard Radovid won't rest till he's killed them all. Every last one, Yennefer and Triss included. Moving as speeches go, now get to the point. Why are you telling me this? Because I want you to help me kill Radovid. You that concerned about the mages of the world? Expect me to believe that? Actually, yes. But not because I'm sensitive or it gives me a heartache, true. To my mind, this systemic persecution is foremost a symptom of a far more serious problem. A madman rules Redania. I served Vizimir, Radovid's father, was his head of intelligence for more than two decades. Together, we transformed Redania, made it the North's most powerful realm. Any idea what made it strong? It's armies, I'd wager. And you'd bloody lose, you idiot. Mass mobilization, inciting peasants to take up their scythes, straighten them. Where's the art in that? Much harder to build a strong state with healthy commerce, manufacturing, solid alliances, progressive science, and fair, independent courts that hand down just judgments. Vizimir and I managed to do just that through years of fucking hard work. I will not sit on my hands as that little shit squanders that. Radovid the stern, my ass. Radovid the witless, I'd say. Will you help me, Geralt? I don't kill kings. Just not a regicide. Rumors to the contrary be damned. I know. I'm merely asking for your aid in organizing the assassination. Someone else will strike the blow. <sighs> Dijkstra. Might not have heard this, though I'd find that hard to believe. But witchers are neutral on principle, so... Oh, bollocks. That's a convenient excuse you lot try to hide behind every time the temperature rises. It's grown hot, my friend, and it grows hotter still. Pyres burn in every city. For majors, great and small, your female friends included. For non-humans, for witchers soon. Is that the North you espouse? The North you're prepared to live in? Silence. Cards close to your chest, I understand. To slay a king, it's not exactly some bloody necker contract. You think on this. Think on what I said. And if you conclude you'd rather change the course of history instead of riding its current to hell, you come find me. At the Passiflora in the garret. I'll be waiting with my mates. I'll think about it. So long, Geralt. <laughs>